Riverfront Park is flourishing. I mean, just to go ahead and think about it. Pig out in the park wasn't too long ago. The reopening of the pavilion that includes dynamic light shows. And now we have the Sister Cities Garden. The latest update to Riverfront Park has been in the work for 14 years. Uh, some of our great leaders of the Sister City Association have been working on this now for all those years. Mayor Condon says the Connections Garden was pivotal in the overall vision of upgrading the park and the garden embodies different cultures. Standing at 11 feet tall is a replica lighthouse from the city of Nishinomaya in Japan. Just a few yards away is an Irish harp that bellows out some soothing tunes. Actually, the site of the, uh, of the Connections Garden is where the Japanese pavilion was, and we have a marker here in the ground that shows that. The new addition won't be the last of upgrades. Still to come on the North Bank is a playground and basketball court that'll open in a few years. The immediate future is still in mind, though. We'll also see some new activities in the uh, pavilion through the fall and winter. Uh, so Fall Fest will be coming back this year. Uh, so we'll see uh, possibly a maze happening someplace in the pavilion. We'll also see some yoga uh, and we'll continue to do our free tour, heritage tours uh, here at the park as well. Moog says he expects all of the recent efforts to bring a renewed life through the park. Reporting from Riverfront Park, I'm Brandon Jones, Crim2 News.